What's up, man, players? This is Man Talk 24-7 here with my second ranked match of the year. I have Oakland, and my opponent has the Tampa Bay Bucks. Can you? Nah, Jacoby Ford didn't have it, man. I thought he was going to take it all away, but he didn't have it. Here we go with the one-play touchdown, man. Motion-wide dig. I will be posting that play in a couple days. Don't even worry about that. I'll be posting that play shortly. So here we are, man. This game, I'm really liking Madden 13. I mean, what am I saying, Madden 13? I'm really liking Madden 25 so far. The run game, yeah, it's good. But do I think it's overpowered? No, I don't think it's overpowered. But my run D can definitely use some work. But, I mean, thankfully, we tackled Doug Martin. But he gets in anyway. It doesn't even matter. So the score is 7-7. But so far, the comp, I mean, the comp has not been there, man. I'm not even trying to sound cocky or brag, but the comp has not been to my liking so far. So I'm hoping the more ranked games I play, the better competition I will play. But look at that pick, man. See, that's the thing, man. People don't understand. I had people ask me if I was going to be posting tips. I mean, that was, I think, on Wednesday. I didn't even have the early release. I had the early release for maybe one day. And then my my boy's, uh, what you call it, my boy's season pass thing expired. So then I did it. I mean, I, I got the game on Tuesday at midnight like the rest of the common folks. So I basically had the game for one day and people were asking me for tips. And I don't just put out tips just to put out tips. I don't just... I don't just put out tips to get views or anything like that. I mean, I have to test my tips. I have to be confident in them. I don't like posting trash tips. I mean, every tip that I post, I use. I know it works. I mean, all like that. But the play I'm, I'm using right now, wide receiver corners, I was thinking about posting that play, but after playing this game, I mean, I don't want to set anybody up for failure, and that's what I feel like I would be doing. I mean, I think I threw about two or three picks running that play, so obviously it's not as good as I thought it was in practice mode. It was nasty, but I mean, when it got to the real game, when it really matters to the real game, it wasn't really working for me. But, so, that's just that right now. I just need to stop this guy's run game. That's all I need to do is stop his run game. I mean, this guy just keeps running the ball. If I can make him pass, I'm confident his passing game is it is it good yet so if I can just force this guy to pass the ball I feel like I can stop him I, I I see he really loves the curl route so here I go three guys on the curl and that's my man Moore snagging another pick right there I believe that's pick number two for him that dude had a great game so far but as you see this wide receiver corner play I mean if you see anybody open hey please feel free to tell me I don't see anybody open. I mean, I'm trying to force some throws. I mean, I have like a drag or something. But this play just very, it's just not consistent enough. Not a very good play in my opinion. Look at my controller dying, man. I'm over here messing up. My controller dying. Here goes another pick. That corner route, I mean, it doesn't work. It looks like it works, but that crap does not work at all, and that is why I don't. I'm not quick to post any tips. Just be whoa! What the heck? He broke that man. What? That's why I'm not quick to post any tips because people don't understand how close I was to posting that tip. I mean, I was really close to posting it, but I said, "No, nah, let me let me try to play out a few more reps." I mean, I I really care about the stuff that I put out, and here we go with the touchdown. But guess what? It's getting called back with the pass interference. I'm not complaining about the call. I didn't see it, but I'm going to accept the penalty. Second and 24, he snags on me. Third and 12, does he have anybody open? No, he doesn't. He throws it. Right over my head. Come on, number 93. I know you're a lineman. You're supposed to pick that. He threw it literally right over your head. You got to be at least 6'3. You're supposed to get that pass. Here he goes with the auto motion run play. Runs in untouched to tie up the game at 14 apiece. But I have Jacoby Ford. Look at these Jets. I turn them on and I get to the 20 yard line. <laughs> what am I saying? Turn the Jets, get to the 20. But he cannot stop the auto motion. Uh, the Auto motion play. I mean, I'm gonna just keep running this play until I get in the end zone. That's my game plan, and right now it's working for me so far. But man, 25, I really do enjoy this game just because it's like NCAA, which is a game I enjoyed. 
but without the nagging issues. I mean, the dive tackle, it's still there, but it's toned down. And you catch picks in Madden 25. You really do. I mean, you don't drop nearly as many picks as the NCAA 14. And the user, it is a lot better. I mean, you can actually user throws this year. I really like that. NCAA, people can throw it straight to you. You're like, oh, you have no user. I'm like, I can't do anything about it. But this year, I mean, Madden 25, the ball hawk feature, it's solid, but I don't feel like it's overpowered. I mean, I'm really liking Madden 25 right here. Here we go with the slow motion. Look at this pass. I'll throw a bullet right here. Am I going to snag on him? Of course, I'm going to snag on him. Look at that. Can we score right before? And I don't make it, man. I get tackled at the two. That would have been a nasty highlight, but I mean, I didn't get in there, unfortunately. So here we are, 21-14, his ball, I'm up. I know I can stop this dude, as long as I can stop his running game. I don't respect his passing game at all. Here we go, and that's Moore's third pick, man. I told you that dude was, look at my controller die, I promise you, man. My controller, it has a full charge. I'm not sure what's wrong with it. I mean, I just put in some new batteries for it, and it's just dying. I'm over here looking weak. People, like, just put some new batteries in. I mean, I have some new batteries in. It's not like I don't have my new batteries in. And there goes Terrell Pryor fumbling. That is one thing I have noticed also is quarterbacks fumble a lot more on sacks this year. I mean, a lot more. Is it a problem? I don't think it is because you get blindsided. The way people in Madden do, you you should fumble. I mean, so I don't really have a problem with it. Just look at those moves, though. Doug Martin, I mean, that thing was a problem in this game. But I play with Tampa, and I will tell you, Tampa, they just, they don't have it for me. I mean, I'm not sure what it is, but I mean, I'm serious when I say they don't have it. I play with them. They dropped about seven passes for me, and that's all I need to see. But I need to get in the end zone over here looking weak. But guess what, man? I have a 90-speed quarterback. I'm going to use him. Look at these moves. Put him on the Jets. Look at that 30-yard scramble. I mean, what am I doing? I have Terrell Pryor. Why am I not scrambling? So here we go, scrambling again. Get off me. Look at, the, look at that vision, man. And then... Dang, he gets hurt. So now I have Matt Flynn, and I will tell you, this guy is horrible. Do not let that pass fool you, man. That dude is horrible. I mean, he's trash. I mean, I mean, I mean I'm mean, i dogging him out, but he really just is not good at all. I mean, I mean, serious, that dude is not good at all. And luckily, he only had to throw one pass for me because I scored on it, luckily. And Doug Martin, he... That dude's tough by himself, but I know. Look at this, man. More again. Is that his fourth pick? I don't even know. I mean, I, st I lost count so far. He just keeps he, he keeps trying to throw curls on me. I don't understand it. He just keeps trying to throw curls on me. I'm, I'm thinking I'm not going to allow that to happen. You're not going to beat me by throwing curls. I'm sorry. And that's why you do not throw an out route on Darrell Reeves, people. Please do not make the same mistake I did. This has to be the third time I please reconnect controller popped up. But please do not try to throw an out route on Darrell Reeves. It's really not worth it, people. It honestly isn't. Four of one, I run commit, and we stop the QB sneak. Let's go. That would never happen in NCAA, man. I swear I'm liking this man 25 game a lot, especially with all the new running moves that they added to the game. I don't think it's overpowered at all because you, you lose a lot of energy with these moves. And there goes Terrell Pryor being Terrell Pryor, man. I think that was Terrell Pryor, Matt Flynn. I mean, the Raiders, they can never have a good quarterback. I don't understand it. I mean, if the Raiders ever had a good quarterback, they would be the squad. But they always have a quarterback being a glaring weakness. And Charles Woodson, he, as you saw in that diamond swat, he's he's a monster, but he just he just slow. I mean, he's like 38. And he has like 83 speed. That man is slow, very, very slow. And as you see, this guy just keeps throwing curls. He really does not care. He's just going to keep throwing him. And I drop a pick. The game should have been over right there. Second and 10. I'm playing my all-out coverage defense. He sees him coming across the field. And I lurk him. And I drop the pick again. Man, why do I keep dropping picks? It's not making any sense for me. I'm lurking with more. He throws it right to me. I drop the pick again and guess what 
I dropped a pick again, man. Four straight drop picks. Just as I was saying, they don't drop picks in this game. But it really doesn't matter because I get the W right here. I hope you enjoy watching this gameplay, man. Look out for more gameplays and tips in the future. He sent me a message and said respect to so respect to him. And thanks for watching.